This is the pantry, and in the pantry, this is the buffet area, and there are a number of stations serving different foods. So as you can see here, there's the curry house, there's the fat cow, which is a barbecue type thing, or roast um, station. Nick and Tony's Italian sticks to Chinese. There's a sugar bar, which obviously is the, um, the desserts. Mexican, Hook's Fish and Chips, and McGregor's Garden. Now, I think McGregor's Garden is the salad. The salad bar, yeah. So there's plenty of variety. This is the pantry. We are here. This is the buffet. The buffet restaurant. We'll go and see what it has to offer. We're a bit short of time now with the delay on getting on board. It's usually a choice of two soups with a selection of bread rolls to accompany them. So today I have got roast carrot soup, which sounds a little bit boring, but it's absolutely delicious. Lots and lots of flavour. And they have um, the usual lovely bread rolls and butter, but I decided to go for the corn, um, the cornbread again from the um, Mexican place. This is a, um, a corn muffin. There, lovely and spicy to go with my soup. Oh, this looks, look at this. There we go, look. And a good selection of salad items as well. What did you get on your salad today? Apples, but I thought it was potatoes. <laughs> and because, yeah. because my eyesight's absolute <laughs> rubbish. So. And does it go? No. You're happy with not your really, apples? No, You're not no, happy no, with no, your no, apples? No. But that was your own choice. Yeah. Okay. Enjoy. This is the curry house. Hello. <laughs> Hello. And the Mexican. What have we got today? Mm. One of my favourite things when we come away on the on PO cruise, the first thing we always get, or the first thing I always get. Uh, for lunch is the curry and I just I don't know why I just now have it set up in my head that I want the curry and it comes on these little trays and you can pick pick all the different things that you want so I've got um, tomato rice I've got a vegetarian curry little poppadoms some chutney and a little salad to go with that but they had um, oh, they had chicken vindaloo they had um, a fish curry some Bombay potatoes, um, I think that was it, and some other chutneys, but this is enough for me. And I've gone for a vegetarian option today, um, just to mix it up a little bit. Um, so I've gone to the Mexican station and I've got some lettuce, some avocado salsa, some tomato salsa from there, I know it's a bit mixed up, but uh, some cheese and then I've got some sour cream and volcano dressing. Right. Something like that. So uh, yeah, no mate in there whatsoever. But it looks absolutely beautiful. Yeah, I, I want to know what a volcano dressing is. Volcano? Well, he said it's hot. Because I said volcano, does that mean it's hot? He said yes. I don't know where he's put it now. It's over here. So you have to say, is it red hot or is it molten hot? Well, there's, actually, there's jalapenos on here as well. So we'll see how we go. Mm. It's got a kick hot. <laughs> A beautiful flavour though. I'm not sure what it's. Uh, oh wow! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, kicks you right in the back of the throat. Yeah, got me right there. <laughs> no. So uh, I'm going to mess this up a little bit now, so you can see it. Yeah, there's the uh, there's a tomato salsa under there. There's the avocado. We've got some jalapeno peppers on here. Uh, lettuce as a base. It's just a salad that I put together from the Mexican station, um, and it's uh, vegetarian. And okay. it's pretty much vegetarian on. I was going to say the vegetarian and all of them, but there isn't on the roast really, and the fish and chips is really just chips. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Sticks is the Asian. And then fish and chips. Hello! Hello! Hello. <laughs> I'm good, thank you. Yes. This looks beautiful. What did you get for your main course? Fish and chips. The guys were all waving to me and talking to me, so I thought, oh, I'll get some fish and chips. <laughs> so, what do you think? I don't know, I haven't tried it yet. And then let's see so what you think of it. Is that like a tempura batter? I think so, yeah, it's not very crispy. Um, 
but the fish looks beautiful inside. Mm. Very hot. Yeah, you can't complain about the heat of the food, the temperature mm. of the food. Mm. No, it's beautiful. Nice. Yeah. Good. Okay, let's have a look what's on the dessert menu. So we've got some rum and raisin pudding, vanilla custard, um, different types of milks are available. Do you want them? Yeah. Yeah. We have some blueberry pound cake, strawberry panna cotta, caramel gato, jello, chocolate mud cake as well. What shall we go with today? Wow. This is the sugar bar couldn't make my mind up so I, I narrowed it down to two and had both <laughs> chocolate mud cakes and strawberry panna cotta in the pantry they do a kids dinner between 4 30 and 5 15 uh, junior cruise links so we'll have a quick look and see what it's uh, it's buffet style similar to the normal food in the pantry Okay. So tonight on the kids menu we've got hello <laughs> we've got a uh, what's that pie uh, it's like a shepherd's pie okay. so that's uh, really beefy with a nice Lovely. crusty top on the um, some turkey mm. noodles vegetables yeah, that's some really beefy pie. got some lovely vegetables we've got some egg noodles yeah. with baby prawns turkey with gravy we've got the deep fried uh, mozzarella sure. sticks and then we've got beautiful um, pumpkin uh, pumpkin in um, oh it looks absolutely beautiful and then yep. for dessert they can have apple crumble who wouldn't want apple crumble yep. and a triple ice cream bowl okay. or beautiful. jelly and rainbow cookies lovely thank you, thank you. wouldn't mind some of that stuff on the proper pantry journey especially the mozzarella sticks lovely breakfast at the pantry there is a selection of cereals, fruits and yogurts, and some more fruit and then syrup over here. Now we move on to the hot stuff and these selections are always available as baked beans, eggs, bacon, black pudding, and what have we got over here? some spinach, cheese and egg pie, game various stations, um, some bacon, some spinach, and looks like a baked ham. Again, some potato crisps. These are always available. Good morning. How are you today? All good. And some some noodles. Good morning. How are you today? Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. So that's the pantry for breakfast. A great selection. Very quick. And especially if you're getting off the boat doing a short tour, this is a fantastic option. This is our final breakfast on the Pacific Encounter. Um, the food we have not been able to fault at all. And even though it's last day, the standard is still exactly the same. Alison's got some poached eggs here. That, and this is from the pantry. We're in the pantry, so bearing in mind that this is like, self, well, not self-service, they serve you, but um, let's have a look and see how that egg is. <laughs> a couple of eggs for myself from a buffet style. Mm. Uh, yeah, uh, you can't complain about that. This is the full, the full thing. Um, yeah, the full selection as, as ever and um, not rushed at all. So we're now 8 o'clock. I thought it was going to be horrendously rushed and, and lots of clattering and things going on and couldn't get a table. It's beautiful. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. I'm having a light breakfast just to get me off the ship with some bacon, eggs, sausage and black pudding. Um, but I did have some fruit and yogurt to start with. So a quick final pan around the pantry. You see there are plenty of tables still available. This is the drink station at the pantry. You can get sort of fresh water and I'm not sure what's in these taps here. Can you see? Um, I'll not try them. Alison's actually just accidentally oh, pressed it's sparkling water, cold water, and just water. Oh, okay. And yeah, because Alison's just accidentally pressed the button on the coffee machine and said, don't go and do it again. <laughs> and filled the cup with it's, um, milk. <laughs> it's touch screen, and <laughs> I just filled it up. But it is coffee, hot milk, hot water. Um, actually, our daughters would love this because they could bring their own pot noodles. 
and <laughs> there wasn't anything they liked to eat. This is open, at, I believe, 24 hours a day, so you can come and get tea and coffee if you, if you so wished. Okay, so there is skim and full cream milk available, but it says soy milk, rice milk, uh, almond milk and lactose free are available on request. Um, so whether there's somebody here 24 hours a day to do that, I don't know. Oh. Everything is really hot, it's not like lying out there and, and just going cold. And you don't serve yourself, it's all served to you, beautifully presented. So you're quite safe that people aren't touching the food and putting it back and mixing it all up, that kind of thing. Couldn't recommend it um, high enough and um, I'm sure you would find something that would tempt you. Um, actually, you can, you can eat it outside as well if you want to eat around the pool. There's nothing stopping you taking the food out. And there's a little overflow section just at the end here that's a little bit quieter if you want to get a quieter spot. You don't like sitting um, close to a lot of people. It's not actually terribly noisy, but if you want somewhere a little bit quieter, there's always there. So, highly recommend that you give this a go. I'm going to tuck in. 